Hello, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be playing Clap Clap. It is a short horror story about house sitting, and apparently wacky things are going to happen. Decided to play this to celebrate 500 subscribers. We're at 499 at the moment, but I'm sure by the time this gets edited and posted, it will be 500. I uh, just wanted to say appreciate it. Instead of doing like a community post like I was considering, I figured I'd just do, you know, what I always do, post a short horror video. So let's just get right into it. October 8th, 1984. I saw an ad in the newspaper about a house-sitting job. Since I was short on cash, I decided to sign up. What could go wrong? Quite the eerie neighborhood, huh? Wow, this is like mega... PS2 style graphics, like wowzers. It's like almost just blurry, like it's not even pixelated, it's just a blur. Howdy, is this the guy I'm s what are you doing? <laughs> are you checking your mailbox, sir? Find Maxim's house. Excuse me, I'm trying to find a house on this street, could you help me out? Eh... Uh... Sure, which house are you looking for? I'm looking for Maxim's place. He hired me to look after it while he's away. Maxim? Oh, that's interesting. He usually asks me to watch his place. Ooh, somebody's jealous already. Marco Batovsky. I'm Marco Batovsky, by the way. Nice to meet you, Marco. Can you tell me where his house is? Of course. It's two houses down. Mine's right here. Our neighbor, Savo, in the middle, and then Maxim's place. You can't miss it. Thanks, Marco. Appreciate it. No problem. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'll just go to my home automation system. Or, I just got my home automation system in the mail. I'm really excited. I could tell. I could tell you're excited. Oh, that sounds interesting. What do you do? Uh, or, what does it do? Jesus. I can't read. It's late at night. I'm sorry. Well, it's supposed to make life a whole lot easier, you know, controlling the lights, temperature, even the security system. Pretty cool stuff. Alright, dude. You're telling me a life story here. I'm getting a little bored. Wow. That does sound convenient. Why did you decide to get it? Oh my god. Partly because of the recent disappearances happening around here. But mainly because our neighbor Savo got one and won't stop raving about it. He left for vacation right after installing it. Said it was built-in surveillance systems and all. Guess he wanted to keep an eye on things while he was away. Well, I hope you enjoy setting it up. Thanks for your directions, Marco. No problem. If you need anything, I'm just a house away. Wow, Marco. Even though your head is too big for your body, you're pretty cool. Okay, so this is Marco. Mako, Marco. I already forgot his name. This should be Savo. And then all the way down here should be the house that I'm watching. Can I check his mail? No. Where's the... Doesn't have a path. I just have to walk on lawn. I think the homeowner mentioned the keys should be... Or would be in the backyard. I should go check. I mean, all right. Hopefully he has a gate. Oh wow, not even. I can just walk right into this guy's house. Can I run? Oh yes, I can. Just a little bit. Just a brisk jog. I think they said they put it in the flower pots. That is a key. I'll take it. Ah, uh, there they are. Let's see if these work. I gotta go all the way back. The wind chime is a nice addition. 
Why did everything go quiet, like, all of a sudden? Just dead silence. That worked. It is so dark. Can I get in here, please? Why is it... I guess I'll close it. Oh, I control the door. No wonder it closed so slowly. Oh my goodness. Well, that's a uh, welcoming. They did say it was a smart house. What a smart house you are. Read note on fridge. Oh. Whoa. Mysterious killer. Fuck off. What a beautiful family you have. But fuck off. Why would you leave pizza out like this? You're gonna get somebody sick if they eat that. Did he say there was a note on the fridge or in the fridge? I'd like to believe he said in the fridge. This looks delicious. Don't mind if I do. Read note on fridge. There is no note, unless it's on the side. Why would you put it on the side? Hey, thanks for house sitting. Please make sure to check the mailbox, water the plants, throw out the trash. P.S. Press Q to toggle the lights on and off in any room. P.S.S. Once you're finished, help yourself to food in the kitchen. Absolutely. Mailbox, plants, trash. A to-do list, just like home. All right, time to get acquainted with this place. I should take a quick tour, check out all the rooms. Explore rooms. Oh, you clap them open, or on, open. Well, this is the garage, room number one. This is the John slash laundry room. Love it. Um, this is like a pantry. That doesn't count as a room though. That fan is blowing. Caution. Do not enter. We'll, we'll get to that in a minute. An office? Why would it close on me? A bathroom with one million ducks. You or wait, did it just say use? Oh. Cool, this is a bathroom. Wow, I like swing that open so hard. And this must be the bedroom. House seems pretty well, yeah, it's a house, dude. Now let's tackle that to-do list. First up, gotta grab the mail. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Can't leave that lying around. It's locked. Oh, no. I wanted to snoop a little bit. All right, the mail first. Why does every door open so funny? <laughs> what a fucking photo. Missing. Please help. Chemcall Zexen, 25 years old, 170 pounds, 5 foot 9, short king, short king in the house. Last seen the 23rd of September 1984 on Salford Park wearing a black sweater and black hat. He was doing house sitting services. All right. I'm nowhere near 
Missing house sitter, huh? I'm nowhere near as cool as that guy was. Sounds like the beginning of a mystery novel. Wonder what happened. All right, bills sorted. Now, time to show those plants some love. Can't have them wilting on me. Grab the watering can from the garage. Gotta take care of the plants. This was, this is literally the moment I've been waiting for. I saw this game and read, or I didn't read, I saw that uh, there was a screenshot of you watering plants and said, you know what? Nope. I gotta pick it up right. Oh, nice, I can just push it. But yeah, I saw that you could water plants and I was like, uh, yes, please. Oh yeah, these plants need some water. Is this working? That is working. That's plants one of five. Here you go, plants. I hope you grow big and tall one day. Perfect. What the fuck? There's a guy on the other side of the fence creeping. Hey, I'm watering plants over here. Can you not clomp through the mud and breathe heavily? Alright, dude, whatever. He can hear me watering. Try not to step on the plants. Alright, next, taking out the trash from the kitchen. I gotta go put the watering can back in the garage where I found it. Okay, apparently, uh, I'll just leave it right there. I'll grab it later. I definitely will not forget. The garbage. Wow, this bag is heavier than expected. And what's with the bones sticking out? Maybe I should lay off the detective novels for a while. Yeah, dude. It's all in your head, bro. Oh my... You scared the shit out of me. Who are you? And he yelled, Stop! Oh, these are the... You scared the shit out of me. Inspector... Ristolino. I'm Agent Ristolino, Federal Investiga Investigation Bureau. I need to ask you a few questions. Uh, sure. What's this about? There have been reports of disturbances in this area. Disappearances, strange phenomena. We're conducting an investigation. You, or yeah, I've heard. Everything's fine here, just taking out the trash. Are you sure? We've reason to believe there's more to this neighborhood than meets the eye. Yeah, a hundred percent. Just taking out the trash, you know? All right, but keep your eyes and ears open. We need to get to the bottom of this. Of course, we'll do. Thanks, Inspector. No problem. Stay safe out there. Get swatted by Ristolini. Ristolino, Ristolini. I can't even remember his name already. Look at him. Look at him walking away.
All right. Oh, do I have to open the lid? Can I open it with the trash? Nope. Why is this lid so heavy? Oh my god. Wow, he's really going. Can I lift it? Come on. Come on. I can't lift it anymore. Okay, well, I mean, I'm done here. Done with my chores. Now it's time to eat. Excuse me? What in the hell was that, I say? Hey. I just saw a man in here. Where? Check the upstairs rooms. There's some banging. I wonder which room will have creature in it. Not this one. Oh, come on. What about this one? Will this one have the creature? Or assailant? Wait a minute. I must be tired. I should grab something to eat and go to sleep. Sounds good. I am hungry from all the work I just did. The pizza's gone. They stole my fucking pizza. And all the meat. Put cereal on bed upstairs. I'm really just gonna eat a bowl of cereal in the homeowner's bed? I am the most disrespectful motherfucker on the planet. This is not the bedroom. I can't remember which one was the bedroom. Mmm, that bed looks incredibly comfortable <laughs> to eat cereal on. Perfect. I will lay on this bed and eat cereal. So the movie being shown in this segment of the game is a real movie that has real copyright protection on it. Don't know why the creator would put this in here without permission from the creator of the movie. But we're here now, so I need to blur and mute just for the time being. Sorry. What the hell? It's 2.43 a.m. What the heck? What was that? Did he turn off my TV? Oh no, the homeowner's gonna fucking kill me. Every door in this room has been blown off the hinges, dude. What is going on? Hmm. You can't turn the lights off on me. I also have the ability to clap. And as long as I have both of my hands completely intact, I can keep turning them on. Okay. There's a rubber duck. Did that just... What is going on? I could have... Ins I could inspect something. I guess not. Okay, well apparently... This thing... Holy fucking cannoli. Jesus Christ. Hey. What did it just say to me? You can't make me leave. Who the fuck do you think you are? Are you the house sitter or is it I? Rubber ducky question mark? 
See you later, rubber ducky. Oh, another rubber ducky. Oh shit, I'm supposed to run? I gotta go back here. Uh, dude. Nuh uh. Oh, he's breaking it down. He's dropping it. He's dropping it low. Wow, he's actually got really good at, uh, like, intelligence. See you later, alligator. I'm out of here. No. Nuh-uh. What? Yeah. I'm Audi. I'm Audi like an R8, my friends. Oh, I just saw him. He's in the... the light. I kept running until I reached the nearest police station. While investigating, the authorities found Marco's lifeless body in his house. Meanwhile, Maxim's remains were found stuffed in the trash bag outside his house. Their neighbor, Savo, has disappeared under similar circumstances. His remains have yet to be found. Despite the eerie scratches on the walls and my harrowing account, no trace of the creature is ever discovered. The case remains unsolved, leaving an unsettling mystery behind. Thank you for playing my first ever indie horror game. I hope you enjoyed playing as much as I enjoyed making it. I will be releasing more horror games in the Nightmare Files series. Okay, now you're going to plug your stuff. Fine. I'll allow it. Thanks, Maxim. There we go. We survived. The creature did not get us. We were not arrested or falsely accused of anything. What a happy, happy ending we had. Well, thank you for watching. Thank you for 500 subs. Once again, all the love and support on the Unspoken video. That video has gone and done things I never thought possible. Uh, so I really appreciate everybody who's come here from that. And I will try my best to continue to make things that don't completely suck on the internet. So if you want to stick around for that, I appreciate it. The comments have been incredible too. Thank you so much. Everybody's so nice. Uh, once again, I'll just... I'll try my best to make you proud. I'll make you proud, everyone. Alright, I will see you in the next one.